Alright folks, today we have an awesome matchup between the Eidneth and Spider Fang. Uh, Heidi is running the Spider Fang and Joe is running the Eidneth. They're going to be playing the Star Strike scenario. Uh, the table's all set up and so we're going to get into this. But before we do, if you could like, share, and subscribe, hit the bell. We sure would appreciate that. If you have any comments on rules and things that we missed, go ahead and leave those below. Uh, be nice, of course, but uh, go ahead and leave those below. We love the interaction. So stick around and enjoy the show. I'm going to set up first, so I'm setting up um, my spiders. I have a unit of five, and I think I'm going to set it right up here. It's my first unit. My army is the Clone Spike Clits. I have an army of um, the Spider Riders. A unit of 10 with 5 each. This is a Mangler Squid. Then a Big Bad Spider with um, my Wizard. This is the Scuttle Boss, who is my General. And these are Spiders, uh, a unit of 5. My artifact for my um, Spider, I'm giving it the Nibbly Itably Ring. Which, once per battle at the start of the combat phase, you can pick an enemy unit within three inches of the barrier and roll a dice. On a one, there's no effect. Two to five, an enemy unit suffers a D3 mortal wound. On a six, that enemy unit suffers a D3 mortal wound. For my uh, wizard, right here, I'm giving it the Venom. Venomous Spiderling has a cast value of 6. If successfully cast, pick one enemy unit within 12 inches of the caster visible to them and roll the number of dice equal to the number of models in that unit. For 6 plus, that unit suffers a 1 motor wound. My command trait for the Scuttle Boss is Monstrous Mount and it doubles the number of mortal wounds that are inflicted by this general spider venom ability. Big bad um, moonshine, holy within 12 inches. It does good things for my army. I don't have to take battle shock. Okay, so I get the triumph because my uh, army is 970 points. My opponent's is 1,000. Um, so I'm gonna roll to see what I get. And it is this dice. And on a two, I get inspired, which means once per battle, when a friendly unit is selected to shoot or fight, you can say that it's inspired. If you do so, reroll failed hits rolls that the unit for that unit until the end of the phase. And then before we start our turn, I will lay this token down in a corner before we pick who goes first, and this will affect the board depending on where it's at. Good things for me, bad things for the enemy. So we'll start here. These are my uh, unit of Morsar Guard. Uh, this is an Eidolon aspect of the sea, and he has the Arcane Pearl uh, artifact, which is uh, every time you allocate a mortal wound, or sorry, just a regular, yeah, mortal wound, uh, on a five up, he uh, ignores it. Uh, this is just a regular king, not Volturnos, with a polearm. He has a uh, Born from Agony command trait. And then another unit of Morsar Guard. Uh, the boats in the hero phase, if an enemy unit is within three inches of it, on a you roll a die. On a four up, they take a mortal wound. On a six up, they take d3 mortal wounds. And any time one of my units is wholly within six inches, I get a 6-up ignore wounds and mortal wounds. I'm going to put it in... Let's do that one over there. Yes. Alright. Alright, so turn one, uh, we are going to start with uh, spells. Uh, the only spell I th think I can do right now is Mystic Shield, uh, which will go off with a 10. And I 
I can uh, dispel that, right? Maybe I'd measure it. I get uh, one to cast into the. Too far away? Yeah. Okay. We will be throwing that on this unit of eels. Uh, that, I believe, is the end of my uh, hero phase. Uh, we will come back with movement. Both units of Morsar Guard moved up, but stayed in the protection of the boats. Uh, the Eidolon did the same thing, and the King just moved up a little bit. Uh, and we're gonna prepare for uh, countering. How about shooting? Uh, none, because I'm not close enough. <laughs> and you're also just out for charges. Mm -hmm. So we're going to Spider Fang turn one. Okay, so I'm going to do my hero phase first. I'm going to see, I'm going to use a spell to see if the scuttle tie comes on. So I need a seven to see if I can set up my spell. So I'm rolling, and I got seven, so it goes off. All right, and I get to see if it denies. Uh, with an 11, I believe that denies it. Okay, so then um, I have another spell that I can use. Mr. Chill is a, f a 10, so... Good turn. And you get to dispel it every time. Yep, she gets that. Do you have two dispels? Mm-hmm. Eidolon has two. Oh, nice. For 440 points, I sure hope so. Um, my Mystic Shield is... Okay, so um, I'm going to put it on my general. For my Mangler Squig, I have to roll 3d6 to see how far I can move it, because it has no wounds. And I can move 11. I got 6, 4, and a 1. I moved my uh, group of 10, uh, two groups of 5, so 10 spiders. Then I moved my big bad spider up. Um, my... Um, Scuttle boss is up, uh, and my spiders are up. My other group of five, I move them up, and my mangler squid is right there. So I made sure to stay three inches away from the boat. Did anybody run? Nobody ran. And now we're on to shooting phase. This unit right here uh, gets 20 shots for their missile. It's two tacks apiece for their bows. Who are you shooting at? What? You gotta say who you're shooting at. This army. Okay. Right here. If I have to be within a range of 16 inches, and this is the army that's within 16 inches. So I need fives to hit, fives to wound. So are you using your triumph or no? Uh, sure. So I get to reroll one. So I'm using my inspired. Well, that's a good thing. I got lots of. So I need five. So that's a hit. That's a hit. Hit. Okay. Two more and ones in there. This is the one. There was another one too. And another one. So there's four. Thank you. So we will take these out of the box. And I get to reroll. And that was sucky. Okay. So then these made it through. Five to one. And I got one. And then it's one damage if it goes through. Uh, it is turn one, so I'm in cover. Uh, I need a three. Or oh, was there any rend, I should say? No. No? Okay, so three, I'm saved. Okay. Um, my other spiders over here are going to shoot these guys. And again, they get two attacks, so I will only roll ten dice. And again, five to hit. Five tools. Ooh, lots of sixes. Too bad these aren't fives. Okay, that's not bad. Okay, come on, baby, give me some fives and sixes. So I have one stinking five. Okay. Three up. We're good. My big bad spider also has shooting. And uh, she gets eight dice. Eight range is still 16. Fives to hit, fives to wound. She has no wounds on her whatsoever, so we're still good there. 
Uh, this is Idonet, so you do have to shoot at the closest unit. Okay, so oh, which true. would be this one. So that, I mean, this one's closer. Mm -hmm. Okay, and then I have a which will work better for me. Okay, so five to hit, five to work. Uh, two uh, dice out of that. Come on, baby, give me some fives and sixes. Nothing. These dice, I'm gonna punish them. Stick them in the room. Okay, so this one shot, this one shot, this one shot, and I believe that one did not have any, but I will double check. Nope, shooting's done. This unit failed a charge. My squid made the charge. My big bad spider made the charge. My um, smaller spider did not, and this army failed as well. Uh, so the eels are going to put out their once per battle uh, volt attack. It is uh, each each model gets to roll a d6. On a three, you take a mortal wound. On a six, you take d3 mortal wounds. And we will start over here on the mangler squid. So two on the mangler squid, and then on the other on the big spider. It'll be. Uh, three. Okay. And those are my little ones. Mm -hmm. Which I don't have any stage for them. And this is now uh, ten. So the squig took two and the big spider took three because uh, you do not have any save against mortals. The spider has fourteen wounds, so it now has eleven. My big bad spider. He has a uh, artifact for the nitty itty bitty ring. Once per battle at the start of the combat phase, you can pick one enemy unit within three inches of the barrier and roll a dice on a one with no effect. Two to five, that enemy suffers a D3 mortal wound, and on a six, it suffers D6 mortal wounds. So we're gonna see what I get. Hoping for a six, and I got a five, which means it's a D3 mortal wound. So let's hope for six to at least get three of them. And you get one. One. One model. And I am within range of my boat. So I have a six up. Nope. So I take a one. Okay, so to finish my combat phase, I have So I'm gonna just slide the spider over. This way. So it's in the front. I'm gonna make sure this has its little wounds of, we have 11 left. I have four melee weapons for this big guy right here. The first one we're gonna do is the Spider God Staff, which is a range of one inch. So it's one attack, four to hit, three to wound. And I got it. I got it, three. It's a minus one run. I have cover turn one, so this is gonna be a four up. All right, that's with a six. Okay, the legs are within three inches. Attacks, it's already suffered. So uh, zero to three wounds, which is what it has, because it originally has 14 and down to 11. Um, I can roll eight dice. Four is to hit and three is to wound. Four is to hit, so this is a miss, a miss, a miss. So these all made it. So then three is to one. They all made it, but two, so three made it. And it is a minus one. Okay. So I made four ups. All right. Okay, so Let's one see. damage. One damage mm -hmm. on a six. Nope. So for the veins, it says if I roll a 6, hit roll, that afflicts uh, D3 mortal wounds. We'll see what it does. Then I get 4 dice, a 2 plus. That was bad. Okay, so 2 went through, a 3 to wound. That was bad, so that's nothing. Okay, the crooked spears, I get eight attacks. I need fives to hit, fours to win. 
make it. Okay, so for it's two words. And all three went through. No vent. All right, so it'll be three ups. We're good. Okay. And that is the end of that guy's turn. All right. All right, so the yellow Morsar guard unit is going to attack. They are going to start with their Volt Spears. And I get an extra attack for the Prince. I am wholly within 12 of my King, so the Spears will be re-rolling once. Hitting on threes. And wounding on threes. That is five. Any rent? No rent on those. Okay, so my save is fours. Two, I saved two. They're one damage each. These are the bites. They're going to be hitting on threes and wounding on threes. So that's one, no rend, D3 damage. Okay, so four. I saved it. All right, and then the tails are D3 tax apiece. Three, these are threes. And threes. So it'll be three at no rend, one damage. You guys, if you had bad dice rolls. Usually the dice are hand roll for me. Okay, so I saved one. All right, no one damage piece. So it was two. Mm-hmm. And then that goes away, so I have six lives left. And that is uh, their attack phase. So because I suffered some uh, wounds, I moved down on the, the chart, and um, I have six left. So I suffered six. So then I have to do a plus five for the first one, which is the Hugh Fang filled gobs. For a hit, I need a five. Six is good. It was spinning. Spinning. Okay, so then I need a five for that, then I need a three plus to one. And I got one. And it's a minus one rend. Minus one, so I'll have a four up. We're good. Okay, so then the ball and chain is my next one. Uh, add one to the hit rolls for attacks made with the ball and chain. This model made a charge phase, so it did. It's six dice, and so I get a three plus normal, so it would be a two plus, is that correct? Okay, mm -hmm. so six dice. Ooh, pretty, pretty. Okay, all but one. Then the next one, a three to wound. Sucky dice. I got one. So it's a minus two. Minus two, so I will be at a five up. You got it. Then the next one uh, is four attacks. Then I get fours to hit, fours to one. Okay, I got two. And nothing. Okay, I'm grounding these dice too. That's the end of that one. Turns out, spiders don't like water. Apparently. Apparently not. Uh, so the Morsar guard, uh, we're going to do uh, tails and spears at the same time since they're the exact same stat. I am, however, not within 12, wholly within 12. So I'm not re-rolling uh, ones. So the tails are going to do D3s. Oh, that's a blessing for me. And then there's a prince, so I get plus one to their spear, or his spear attacks. Uh, these are hitting on threes. No re-rolls. And then threes. So we have four. No rend, one damage each. Okay, so I need fours to save. Be nice to mommy. Here we go, come on baby, fours and ups. One. And then these will be the bites on threes. 
No, I'm gonna reroll ones. And threes. So that is one no rend D3 damage. Oh my goodness. Come on, baby. Give mommy a four plus. Yes. Uh, and that is all their attacks. Okay. I still am alive. So there is no battle shock to be had this turn. So we will roll off for turn two. Rolling for turn. It was a two. Okay. Okay, so are you going to take it? Uh, yes, I'm going to take it. Okay. So then we need to drop the um, first objective. So I'll let you roll it on a one to two. It's over here. On a three to four, it's in the middle. And a five to six, it's over there. A one. So it's in the section over here. Okay. So we'll set that up and we'll be right back. Yep. So it ended up going down in the center on this end of the table. I'm moving the um, big bad moon that's in that corner over yonder. So I'm rolling to see where it goes. One, it doesn't move. Two to five, it just moves one. And six, it moves two. And I got a one, so it doesn't move. It stays where it's at. Still affect that corner, which I believe really nobody's in it. So I'm gonna roll to see if my scuttle tag comes on uh, my spell. So I need a seven, and I got an eight. Mm -hmm. Yay! It comes off. I'm excited. Um, it says here that once it is successfully cast, set up the scuttle time model wholly within six inches of a terrain piece. So I'm going to do that. I'm going to set it up. Okay, so the scuttle tie went down, and I'm picking his general to um, roll the six dice on. On a five plus, he suffers mortal wounds. So for each five plus. Is it so just one. Mortal These dice are not not liking me tonight. Okay, so then that's my first one. My second one that I'm going to do. I'm doing my second spell of the venomous spiderless vein. Um, on a six, if it goes off, then I can pick um a, a one enemy unit within twelve inches of the caster visible to them and roll a number of dice equal to the number of models in that unit and for six plus that unit suffers one more to one. Okay, so let's see if it goes off on a six. And it does. It's actually a seven because you're plus one because you're a spider fang wizard. Alright, so I'll need an eight. No. Alright, so that goes off. Okay, so it's 12 inches, so then I'll try for your general, see if I'm 12 inches. And you're way out of sight of the Yeah. You can hit him. Okay. You could even technically hit them if you wanted. But that's probably the best target. These guys right here? Or that one? You said this one? Mm-hmm. Because okay. he can heal himself. Three models. I roll three dice. Is that how that reads? Okay. And I need sixes. And I got one. And it suffers um, one mortal wound. On a six, I'll ignore it. Due to the boat. Nope. All right. So use that to three. Do you count up or down? I count up. Okay. Wounds taken. Okay. Um, so then that's my spells. So then I move this unit. Um, a normal move. Squid is in battle. I move the scuttle boss. Um, the big spider is in battle, and I move the five spiders. My group of ten um, gets two attacks apiece, so I have twenty dice here. Fives to hit, fives to win. Hope that we can get a little something here. It's bouncing out. Okay. So I survive, so out, 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 these 
I made it. So then I need five to one. And so I got one, two, three, three made it. So one damage. Any run to this? No. Nope. Oh, Alright, so I'm at a four up. I take all three. Yay! And then uh, I'm still within my boat, so on sixes. No. All right. Okay, so then um, these spiders right here also get um, the 16 range as well. And I am going to go with this army here. And they, I will make a 10 dice. And again, fives to hit, fives to wound. And bad, 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 and bad. So I got four, so that's pretty good. And I got one. Fours, we're good. Okay, then my uh, big bad spider as well also gets it. Okay, so eight dice. Four and four. So fives and fives. So good, 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 good. Ooh, that's pretty good. Okay, I got six of them, so okay, do the same. Okay. Is there anything that explodes or not? Fives to one. Nope. I don't think so. That's just for the when I do the other ones. So I got two and no damage. No run. No run. Fours. Let me see. Some both. Okay. So that is all of my shooting. Next we're gonna go to the charge phase. So I decided to um, charge. I piled in with the square, kind of rotated them. He has six lives left out of 12. For my first one, for my melee weapon, I get four attacks. The hit will be a five plus. And I got nothing on that one. Then the ball and chain. So then my ball and chain, five. And I need threes to hit, threes to wound. Three is to hit, three is to wound. So those three made it. And three is to wound, so two made it. I'm um, at a minus two rent. Minus two, so I'll have a six up. Okay, damage on that? D3. For both? Yep. Oh. One takes one, and the other takes three. Okay, and so then the next one gets four attacks. I need fours to hit, fours to wound. Uh, about one, and then fours to wound. Uh, about one, so two, no bend. So fours. Okay, one damage. One damage. Uh, that was uh, four damage on the first one, correct? Yep. And then one damage, because I'll actually have female pains on these. Mm -hmm. And then you six up. That much. So I only save one. So, so he still dies, I believe. Yeah? Yep. My main guard did some business. Good job, guys. Okay, that's the end of my... Oh. Combat for my mangler. So the uh, Morsar guard piled into the spiders. So he is rerolling ones on his Volt Spear. The spear. Rolling the one, three, and then threes. So that's going to be two at no rend, one damage each. So I need to save uh, on five. So you said two, correct? Mm hmm. And I saved one. All right, so that's one damage. Back here. All right, and then the bite, which will be hitting on a three. Okay. 
And then D3 tail attacks. Threes. And threes. So that'll be two, no rend, one damage. So I say both. Cool. <laughs> he did a thing. <laughs> so um, because I suffered um, six wounds, I have eight lives left. That um, breaks down my table. For the staff, I get one attack, fours to hit, threes to wound. Got it. Three is to one. Got it. So it's a minus one. 3D damage. Alright, this will be a five up. Nope, damage. One. one. And then ignore it on a six. Okay. The next one for the legs. So the legs, I get seven dice. So then I need fours to hit, threes to one. Like dice like me better. I want to make sure that that's a three. Three to one. So it's a minus one rend. One, two, three, four, five of them. And minus one. So yep. these will be fives. And then damage. One damage. Huh? One damage. Damage. Sixes. Nope. Okay. okay. This should and be three so far. Is hmm? that? Should be three so far. Three. Yeah, because you took one off of the first thing. Right. So that one guy died, then two should go into that guy. Mm -hmm. So the one for the bang, um, I get four dice if the hit. So I need a three plus. If I get a six, then it's a D3 motor one. So I get four dice. So I need three plus for hitting. Okay, one, six. So this one went through, this one went through. So one, six. Um, so it's a D3 mortal bone. So we'll put this over here. So it's a two. So it would be one if you took it. And a six up. Okay. Then I'm gonna finish these guys. So then these guys here, three plus. One goes through, so it's a minus one rend. So five. Damage. D3. So one. Six up. Nope. All right. Okay. Then the crooked spear, I get eight attacks. So fives and fours. So no, no, no. no. Didn't even pay attention. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. Achillean Prince is going to go after the um, big spider. Uh, we're going to do the tail and spear at the same time. D3 on the tail. And then. Oh, on. he dropped the dice. <laughs> uh, these will be on threes and threes. So that'll be one, no rend. Okay, so I need a four to save. And then get a four. All right. And then the bite will be on a three and on a three. And that'll be no rend D3 damage. Okay, so far to save. Nothing? For one. Not bad. I mean, you did the big spider, right? Mm-hmm. Okay, so now this Oh, no, that goes to the collection. That's that goes to the collection? It's gone now. <laughs> I'm totally I mean, there's 36 of them, man. <laughs> I collect dice, too. <laughs> okay, so I'm... I have seven um, lives left, so now that's the end of that battle, so then I get mm -hmm. to go, so I still have that battle, and am I three inches within? So because he charged, he will still get to do a pylon, Okay. and then he'll still be able to attack, attack. with whatever's... But I want to make um, sure I stay, is it three inches from the boat? Yes, but it's very inconvenient. Um, Try to do that because then he's not going to be able to kill that. Is that about right? Mm -hmm. Yep. 
So then I'd be right there. Yep, so you'll be like technically like okay, so I'm just gonna cut it so I don't hit my little spider's arms. Mm-hmm. Is that about right? Yeah. Okay. Okay, my scuttle boss um, is going to be in battle with this little fellow right here. And his melee weapon, he's going to use his spear with two inch range for attacks. So, force to hit, force to wound. Okay, so three of them went through. One went through. So it's a minus one rend. So we have five up. We're good. Saved it. Okay, so the bang is four attacks, one inch. If I get a six on the um, hit, it's a motor wound. And then my uh, command trait is that it doubles. So let's hope for sixes. Let's hope for sixes on the hit roll. Oh, I got one. one. Okay, and then I needed a four to hit, so these two did not go through. So this is a mortal double, so it would it be two? Two. Okay. Yep. Roll two your other one though. Roll your thing. Let you me roll this. Let me do yeah. this one first. Yep. I needed a three to wound, so it's a minus one. So this would be a five. No nope. okay. damage. damage. One. Yep. So three six ups. Oh, you Save got two. two. You got... My fishies protect me. <laughs> so he still takes one. Okay. I have They're nothing ready. else to go with. So you get to pile in with spiders. Oh. Okay, so I piled in. Um, my first guy will get to hit this little guy right here. So I need a five to hit and four sword. I got a five. Okay, so I need a point of wound. Okay, went through. So one damage for the spears. Okay. And then I use six up. No. Okay, so for the fangs, two attacks. So I need fours and fours. So nothing. We're good. You're good there. Now we can go at that battle. Okay. Uh, so is there spears two inch or one inch? Those spears are two inches. Okay, so then that does matter because he could have piled in like that. And he can just do that. And he should be in. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nine! Okay, so nine one attacks for fives and fours. So that's good, good, bad, bad. We said fives, right? Fives and fours. So bad and bad. Okay, so now we need fours. One. At one. No rend. Alright, so four up. Alright. Get two attacks. Uh, for each one I have eight in combat, so I have 16 dice. I need fours to hit. Fours to win. And if I get a six on the hit, Oh, these are fangs. So, good, good, good. Uh, okay, one mortal wound. Okay, so I get one mortal and the rest of it is good. Now I need fours to wound. <laughs> and I got all but one. So three. Any and rent No rent. Yeah. Alright, fours. Ooh, cool. Good job. And then there's the mortal wound, yep. which I'll ignore on a six. Nope. So I do okay. take that. So you didn't do anything with that, right? Right? You didn't take any. He took one out. from the spider. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So that's uh that's that. Okay. So now we do uh, Battle Shock. Battle Shock. Yep. Yay. Hey, I didn't do any battle. I didn't do any. Shocking. So they're fine because the Eidolon. But on a five up, uh, he will run. Oh, we're good. I control the objective, um, so it's round two, so I scored two points for that. Okay. Now we're going to go into Eidneth, turn two. All right. 
So starting in the hero phase, I gain one command point, and uh, the Eidolon spells, uh, he will try to dispel. Um, I believe he needs a seven? Yeah, yeah, it's a seven thing and he dispels it. And that's 11, right? Yep. Okay. So then in my hero phase, I can bring it back on. And then his other spell, Cycloning Mist, which is a casting value of 6, which does not go off. Cool. That is my hero phase. Uh, we will be back with movement. Uh, the king and the Eidolon just moved up a little bit. Eidolon is going to shoot into the spider. Uh, it's d3 shots for three. These would be threes and threes. And that is going to be neg two damage to. Which one are you shooting at? I'm sorry. The, your general. Negative two, so I would need a six for that. Um, because I have a four save, mm -hmm. so I need a six. And is it just one you said? Yep, just one. Okay. Come on, baby, give me a six. Give me a six. Give me a six. Six! All right. Good job. Uh, and then, uh, charges. King. Getting a four. And when he makes a successful charge on a two up. He will do D3 mortal wounds. And takes three mortal wounds. Okay. So it goes from six to three. It has three lives left. And now he's scary again. And then the Eidolon will charge. All right. Oh, you want to make sure you stay close to your boat. Yeah. <laughs> Because you could have moved the full 11 and you didn't. Uh, start with the king. Uh, he is not using his falchion. Uh, I am also a uh, noddler, so I reroll failed hit rolls on the charge. Uh, so pull arm, threes. Rerolling failed on the charge. Oh, okay. And then threes. So that's going to be one at neg two damage d3, or straight three. Sorry, I charged. Okay, baby. Be good to mama, be good to mama. Four. So it is that's straight okay. three damage. Uh, for, you said the squig? Mm -hmm. Straight three damage, so it's gone. So then, yeah, I think three he, lives left. Does he explode or anything? If this model is slain before the model is removed from play, roll a dice for each unit within six inches of the model. Okay. Which will be all four yeah. units. This guy right here to see if he takes mortal wounds. Nothing. Uh, spiders. Spiders. Nothing. And this one. That one takes a mortal wound. Yes, it does. Oh, now, now, it, now it's removed. We're gonna go with the skeleto boss, and it's gonna try and hit the the big fella. So he has five lives left, so we're going to see if we can do some damage before he is taken out of play. So um, we're going to do his spear, he gets four attacks, four is to hit, four is to wound. And nothing. Okay, so then we're going to go with a fang, four attacks, uh, four is to hit, and if it's six it's mortal. Okay, so two. Then it's four is to one. one. And it is. So it was a three. So I got one. So minus one to win. Minus one. So I got four up. Nope. One What's damage. the damage? Damage one. Um, on a six. Nope. Okay. Have this eel go into the uh, big spider. Okay. Um, so we need threes. 
degrees. So that'll be two at no rent. So I need fours. And then he takes it. So what is it? It's one damage each. Okay. And then bite. Threes. Threes. Uh, no rend, D3 damage. So it could be a four. Which is for the big spider, mm -hmm. which is a four. Okay. Nope. D3 for two. And then the D3 tail attacks for three. Threes. And threes. So that'll be two at no rend, one damage each. I need fours, and I take them. So then I have one life left. <laughs> oh. So then that means I get to attack back if I wanted to, but I don't have to worry about that. So I'm going to attack with the spiders. Okay. So okay. one inch or two inches, one attack. Nine? And they should all be able to get all their attacks this time. Okay, so we're gonna go five and four. Okay. Mess, 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 and mess. Okay, so then I need fours. And they all went off, so one damage to four of them. Save two. I uh, need at least one six. Nope, he is gone. I killed an army. Uh, what are you gonna say? The Eidolon. The Trident hitting on threes. We rolling because I charged. Okay. My bad dice rolls. And then threes. So that's gonna be. Two at neg two damage two. So I need six. Mm -hmm. Come on, baby, give me guys. Well, I got a six. Add it up. Okay, so two. Yep. So that'll be four damage. Okay, so then I have one life left. We're gonna see if the shoal can finish her. Two d six attacks for nine. I'm gonna sing the song, don't be cool. And fours. Okay. Uh, I did charge. And then fours. So it'll be three, no rend, one damage. Okay. So I need fours to save it. Come on, baby. Give me some luck. Give me some love. Ooh, all but one. And of course, that's what I have to take it out. Yeah. Okay. Shadow boss is gone. The general is gone. Um, so you get more. That is your go. Okay. And so my big bad spider is going to go after your little dude. Well, you're going to want to pile in because you're going to be able to take some of that into the, the bigger dude. And they have one life left. Doesn't matter. He already went. So you'll have three inches which can pile you into that spot, which means you're within an inch. As long as you stay outside of three of the boat, so you don't yeah. take that shenanigan. It should still be within an inch. She's still within an inch. How many lives left does this one have? Uh, should just be one. Okay, so I'm going to split my attacks and I get four melee weapons. The first one will go here. The second one will go here. The third one will go here, and the fourth one will go here. Okay? So, um, the staff, the god, the spider god staff is one attack. I need a four. And I got a six. I need threes to wound. And it did not happen. With the spider, with the legs, so this one, I get I have one life left. I get four dice and I need fours to hit, threes to win. So I got two. 
three sugar. And I got one. And it is a minus one rend. Four of them? Nope, damage. My, uh, one. Okay, so now we're gonna go the fang into her as well. She gets four attacks. Um, if the hit is a six, it's a mortal. So I need fours to hit. Uh, but if it's a six, it's a mortal. So fours. No sixes, they all hit though. Threes. They all hit, so it would be a minus one rend and a d3 damage. A uh, force. Uh, so save all but one and damage on the one. D3. And I get a three. Two sixes. Nope. Takes two okay. more. So now the last one is going to be in this fella, and I need eight dice. So five to hit, five to win. four is to one. Five to hit, four is to one. So two and four is to one. And I got one, so it's a one damage, no rent. One. That's that, and then I have this battle in the same site. Right, should be able to get three, maybe Which, four of them even in there if you pile in, right? Yeah. Just piled in there. Yep, we piled in for this fella here. So, um, one attack for each one, so I need five to hit, four is to one. All but one. Four is to one. And one at a one damage. Sixes. Yeah, yeah, saved it. Okay, two, four, six. So um the next one is a one incher. So um, he would be piled in. Uh, okay, so that's four. Yeah. So they get two attacks apiece, so I get eight dice. Two, six, eight. So I need fours to hit, but if it's a six, it's a model. One six. And these are bad. So then I need a four to one. And I got one. So one damage. Model here. Okay, and then the mortal wound saves. Okay. Cool. So that is the end of our battle, is that correct? So, battle shock. Um. This one came off of my 10, and I have a bravery of 2 plus, so then it would go from 4 to uh, uh Could I have the. Uh, where is it? Because this yeah, is a yeah, group of 10, in there. and because it's add 2 to the bravery character. Okay. So, um, I think that would be okay if I didn't roll it, or you guys want me to roll it anyway? On a 6, 1 would run. So a 6, 1 would run? Because of bravery. <laughs> I got a 6, of course. Of course. 6 plus 1 is 7, so yeah, 1 runs. That's the end of my battle shot. You roll for a turn. Roll for a turn. Okay. Doesn't, uh, the moon, doesn't the moon move first before we roll for turn? I didn't see who got turn. Who got turn? I got turn. Okay. Two, so it moves in the middle this way. Two. Okay. Okay, and then if you want to roll to see where the comet drops. For the star strike traps. So a four. So with the star strike we rolled in because we're playing on a four foot table because we're playing a thousand points, this is where it landed. It actually landed right in the loom shrine. Arcane bolt. Uh, which does not go off. And then we will do uh, cycloning sea mist 
which is on a six, which is a nine. I can just spell it, right? Yep. Okay, so then and you I really need want to uh, this a one. ten, or can I have a nine plus? Yeah, ten or higher. Come on, baby, come on. I got a ten. Okay. That is both of my spells. Uh, he did not re-roll, so I heal D3 for one. Cool. So he still has three wounds on him. Okay. And then that is hero phase. Uh, so the king is going to put, uh, use one command point to put uh, his ability on him, which gives him plus one attacks to all of his uh, melee weapons. And then he will use it on uh, the Eidolon as well. So it'll be two command points. And now we'll do movement. The only one that could move was the king, and he moved here so that he can charge. Uh, we'll do his shooting, which will be into the spider. It'll be D3 shots for three shots. And on threes. And on threes. So that's going to be one at neg two damage two. So I need a six. And I did not get it. Three only has one life left. Okay, the sucky part is if because you got turned first, I didn't get to heal. You know the other sucky part? You had turned first last time and you didn't remember to heal. That's true. Oh, yeah. Don't make me hurt you. And leave that on the tape, please. <laughs> um, so then we'll go to charging. Uh, the king. And the spiders. Eating a that. There. And then on a successful charge, on a two up, take D3 mortal wounds, which will be three mortal wounds. Okay. So they're two a piece. So take this one out. And then I'll put one on this one. Um, and then it is turn three, so I will go first in combat. King first. And he has plus one attacks to everything. He will use his falchion. Uh, so these will be four attacks, threes, rolling for the charge, and then threes. So that'll be three at neg two straight three damage. So you're gonna do three at, and you said negative two? Negative two. So they have a save of five. Okay. So um, how many is it? Nine damage total. Eight, nine. Okay. Uh, the falchion is threes and fours. So one at no rend, one damage. Jaws and talons. Freeze. I'm sorry, what? Uh, three at neg one, one damage. So I saved one. And then freeze. And three. Will be two no rend two damage. That unit is kind of the only unit that I have left is the unit of five. So it is high tide. So the the unit of Morsar will get to attack before the spiders do, and he will have three attacks. So that'll be two no rend. So then my spiders have a five save. So I saved one. All right, that's one damage. All right, we'll do the bite. And threes. 
All right, that'll be no run D3 damage. Okay, is that just one dice? Wait. Yep. Nope. Three, and then the D3 tail attacks. Four, three. Threes. And threes. Uh, one, no rend, one damage. Five, I did not get it. So now is it my turn to attack back? Yep. Okay, let's see if we can kill this sucker. Okay, so one attack, two inches, I need fives. Didn't get it. The other one is Hang five. on a second. Why are you only taking off the one guy? Oh, oh yeah. because it's one attack. <laughs> Yeah, but there's three dudes there. Okay, so then I need all these other two. Nope, neither one. Okay, so the next one is the fang. Two attacks apiece, so I get six. Four is to hit. If I get a six, then it's the mortal. Big four is to hit. Uh, I got two. Oh, and six? the four is to wound. Oh, you're right. So then two, then two mortals, so you get two sixes. All right. Nope, he is gone. Yeah. You got a battle shock. Oh, I had to battle shock. Mm -hmm. Okay, so they normally have four for bravery. I don't have any special people on that, so I lost two. The only thing that could save you is the loon shrine. I don't know how far away you are, but... I think. I know. Okay, so what do I not need to get? You want a one. Can you give me ones, Just please? One die. Two? Just one die. Can you give me a one, please? Oh, shoot, I got a little again. In the box, one. Ah, oh, damn. Five. So five plus two is seven. Right? Yeah. And your bravery is four. No, so my bravery is, uh, yes, a bravery is four. So the whole unit runs. The whole, the whole unit's gone? Ah, uh, okay. Well, you won. Well, bravery thing in the points, though. Well, because I have no models. Mm -hmm. So it doesn't matter anymore, does it? Good game. All my points, my nine points, no good for me. Okay, we are back. We fought our battle and sadly, all of my spiders died, but I won on points up until the third round. <laughs> I had nine to nothing. Um, so, um, I made some mistakes. I didn't heal my big spider when I should have. Um, and, uh, so that kind of hurt me. Um, yeah, so that was probably the big thing there. And my dice rolls really were bad. Yes. Really bad. Yeah. Um, at the beginning. And I switched out my dice several times and punished the other ones who were <laughs> naughty. Um, so that didn't help me either. Um, but they finally started happening for me at the end, but it was a little too late. Mm -hmm. What do you think? Um, yeah, really, it was, it came down to the dice rolls, because that first turn, well, weren't able to make a few big charges, um, I think... My spell didn't come out. Mm -hmm. I, I think, definitely, if your, uh, boss would have been able to make that charge into those eels, they would have died a turn sooner... And I probably wouldn't have been able to do that. Yeah. And it didn't help that I didn't get, like, you got back-to-back -back turns. Mm -hmm. So I, when I remembered to heal my spider, yep. I didn't get a chance to. So, my bad. The lesson learned. And we have to remember to use command points to uh, make the charges and things like that. We always forget that. Yes. Yeah. We so. forget command points. There's so much to remember and, and everything. It was a good game. Um, I fought to the bitter end. And all of my spiders are licking their wounds. Um, and then building up venom to maybe 
get you again the next time we might get a chance to play. I appreciate you coming to play with me. Um, hopefully you'll come and play again. Thank you for visiting. See you all soon. Well, thanks for sticking around and enjoying the show, folks. We sure do appreciate it. Uh, Heidi's dice roll sure sucked. Boy, the dice gods were not kind to her. Uh, she forgot a few rules, but she'll remember those for next time. But Joe played a solid game, so it was a good matchup. Uh, if you have any questions or comments, go ahead and leave those down below. Things you think we could do differently, we sure appreciate that. Uh, like, share, and subscribe. Hit the bell. And uh, we'll see you in the next battle.